Tell us about the context of this and what's happening with the ongoing prisoners, in particular uh, with uh, Paul Whelan. Well, the president is striking a joyous tone in the beginning there. He's very excited, and it's a success for them to be able to bring Brittany Griner home. There's been a lot of pressure on the administration. We know they've been talking to the Russians, and, and they gave them a, a plan, a trade swap idea in the summer. Um, but obviously, the president then trying to make sure he hammers home that he has not forgotten about Paul Whelan. Paul Whelan is sent to 16 years. He's been in jail for about four years. He's a former U.S. Marine. But the president said there, and I, let me just read this to you, we've not forgotten about him, sadly, for totally illegitimate reasons. Russia is treating Paul's case differently than Britney's. And while we have not yet succeeded in securing Paul's release, we are not giving up. We will never give up. And what U.S. officials are telling us is that with the Russians, it was either Griner or no one. And that's when the president made that decision to bring Brittany Griner home.